Hi there, it's George, your local AI expert from Aotearoa, New Zealand. Sora is the big talk in their AI news at the moment. Sora is a text-to-video model that can generate video for up to a minute long given either text, video, or both as input. At the moment, details about it are pretty scant and only a few people actually have access to it. And in my opinion, Sora is kind of one of the more refreshing announcements for OpenAI since ChatGBT. When I saw OpenAI's announcements throughout 2023, it really seems like that since becoming a for-profit company, they were more just interested in refining what works for them instead of coming up with new research. But with this latest announcement, I feel like I'm getting a better idea of OpenAI's path towards AGI, which is of course their long-stated goal. The only way to build an AI capable of human-like understanding and common sense is to enable it to interact with the world the same way a human being would. So knowing that, it's actually kind of strange that OpenAI started with ChatGPT, which is a text-only model. Because with humans, the first way we interact with the world is not through language, let alone through text. But it really seems like OpenAI is aware of this fact, and thus they added image understanding to ChatGPT in 2023, and video understanding is really just a natural extension of that capability. I actually tested image understanding capabilities of ChatGPT in a previous video. If you haven't seen that video, go watch it. Link in description below. When Sora is released to the public, it will be very quickly integrated into ChatGPT to provide video understanding. But here's a twist. Even when Sora gets integrated into ChatGPT, ChatGPT will not be able to understand a film after watching it. Why? Because Sora does not give audio understanding to ChatGPT. They do not have an audio understanding model. Now I'm referring specifically to an audio understanding model, not an audio transcription model, which OpenAI already has. It's called Whisper. You can check it out with the link I've put on below. With an audio transcription model, the only thing it can understand is the language parts of an audio, whereas with audio understanding, it should be able to understand all sounds. But I think OpenAI is working on an audio understanding model as we speak. ChatGPT currently only has two modalities of understanding, vision and language understanding. Adding Sora to ChatGPT simply only extends the vision understanding component, so still at two. But once you add audio understanding, that brings the number of modalities of understanding to three. And that's where it gets interesting with cross-modal associations. You see, with only two modalities, there's only one combination of associations that you can have. So in this case, ChatGPT is just language to vision. Once you have three, there's three times as many combinations. There's language to audio, language to vision, and vision to audio. Now, here's where I'm gonna do a little bit of speculation and say that this new audio understanding model will instead be trained by leveraging Sora's video understanding. And that way they can use just training data that consists of vision to audio associations in order to train it. And instead, it will get its audio to language understanding capabilities by using Sora's vision understanding as a proxy. This makes sense because there's billions of hours of footage on the internet and most of it has an associated audio track. Whereas there's only so many novels that have been made into films and most of the serious fans think they suck. But joking aside, it's actually more natural to associate vision events with audio because they're both time series data. However, this is where I feel like I've hit the limit of my understanding of multimodal models. An audio understanding model, trained in this manner, added to ChatGPT, I'm still not convinced it will grant ChatGPT the ability to understand a film by watching it, because language is such a core component of understanding a film. In order for it to successfully understand a film, it needs to be able to also perform audio transcription. It is very likely that OpenAI will simply leverage the work they've already done in Whisper to achieve this. But what I find poetic is that if you think of adding Sora to ChatGPT as metaphorically adding eyes to ChatGPT for the first time, then this audio understanding model is like adding ears to ChatGPT for the first time. 
As always, thanks for watching my video. Don't forget to like my video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.